Now, Asa is actually flowing to another location where a group of men are all over this beautiful young lady, which he actually realized that it was actually Charlotte, Captain of the Blue Roses Knight, and she using her briars to push the man back while Sue show up with another dress for her to put on and which she almost be embarrassed and she actually I mean, she actually would actually say her no but when Asa tries to get her to stop he bumped into soul and try to <clears throat> try to hurt him for doing that by which we actually seen Sue and Charlie go into the dressing room for Charlie to put on a new dress, which we actually seen everybody is actually all over her, including Funeral, who was actually is with the black bulls enjoying themselves, in which we actually seen them threaten the men who actually look at her, which so actually tells them that only Knights of the Blue Roses can look at her which she, which I can honestly tell that she might I mean she is getting this type of attention but which we actually seen what people were actually will leave because of that however we actually see Yami showing up to Asta after he flew him across the area in which we seen Charlotte freaking out about Yami coming over there I mean over here in which she actually asked him about what is he wearing especially the bottom half which she actually is freaking out about in which we actually seen Vanessa coming over to Yami in which she seen Charlotte and there are actually intents of what she actually thinks and which she actually knew that she would be jealous but we seen Vanessa challenging Charlotte which she actually would decline but of course Soul actually accepted on her behalf even though she actually didn't say anything and her face was completely blank so Finwell decided to do a cosplay contest in which everybody is actually decided to see which we actually seen Charlotte dress up as a witch while Vanessa actually dress up as a, a lady of the cloak which she <clears throat> would which she would get much attention for that but it actually ended up drawing as a tie so the next contest actually got Charlotte putting funeral in the briars which everybody who agreed with his idea can actually step forward because none of them want to do that anyway so they actually have no idea how they're going to do a next challenge until Vanessa actually overhear about Clover I mean the Clover Kingdom's new premium beer that actually came out which she decided to do a drinking contest for that which she actually decides to do that contest as well so they actually decide to start which Vanessa actually say that she'll hold her liquor but she actually end up falling asleep and then Charlotte claims to do the same but actually it turns out that she cannot hold her liquor as well and which she actually tried to hold it all down and she actually tried to not embarrass herself as we actually seen it actually happen, we also seen a backstory about her family being under a curse, 
which the Wilsley family is actually trying to figure a way to break the curse that placed on Charlotte. And the witch actually told him once she turns 18, her curse will be activated. In which she told her parents she'll be strong and stronger. And she actually did. However, once she turns 18, her curse is activated, causing the briars to spin, spawn out, out of control and trapping everybody around her. As soon as she thought that she wanted to give up, Yami actually appears and cut the briars away, in which she, he told her that the Magic Knight squads are full of energy, and she actually decided to take control of the curse. As she actually did, we actually head back over to the present, where we seen Charlotte actually take a look at Yami, and she actually passed out, which another draw actually happens. However, it is almost time for the Magic Knight star results, in which they are actually headed over to the stage to see, <coughs> sorry, to see which Magic Knights to have the most stars on their squad. Now we actually seen a backstory of Charlotte and her curse, and I have to be honest, some parts of this episode are funny, but when we get to the curse parts, we actually, you know, backstory of her curse, we can understand why she hates men. But we're actually going to the next episode of the squads with the most stars. So I cannot wait to see how this will actually happen. So anyway, like this video, subscribe for more, and comment up with anything about the episode. You guys can also follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Tumblr, and like my Facebook page. I'll see you in this, and we got right here saying sign out. Laters!